in the autumn of 2018 in Randebergen in Göteborg in Sweden, me and Lorna and David, we um, were outside and um, we met a guy, a Polish guy called um, Pavel. He was outside uh, having a drinking party with his Polish friends when he came up to me and he had bottles of beers and alcohol in his hands and he asked me to drink with him. But um, I didn't want to have the, the spirit, uh, the spirit of drunkenness. So I thought of why not having Pavel taste uh, the spirit of God instead. So I asked him if he had any pain in his body that we could pray for. And he told us that he had the pain in his shoulder, and that's when we started to pray for him. All pain go in the name of yes. Jesus. Yes. Okay. I'll be there. Okay. Try to move okay. your shoulders. See, is this pain is still Marek. there? Pojechał z nim za 20 minut na ten tutaj. Pyta się, czy jest lepiej. Czy czujesz ból? Czy czujesz ból? No. Nie czujesz? Ja w dole. Co? Nie czuję. Co? Nie czuję. Ale poważnie pan. Nie czuję. 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 Nie look at the alcohol again but I'm quite sure he he got sober the pain is gone and uh, there's no talk anymore about sitting down and 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 drink with them his friends from Poland are from a Catholic background so it's no surprise that um, they tell Pavel to do the sign of the cross And David uh, here he asks if anyone else has pain so he calls that person forward and Pavel he uh, takes uh, a short walk and he swings his arm back and forth you need to talk to him tell him that okay. Jesus touched him maybe, uh, maybe he can Jesus cię dotknął. Tuba. Jesus. Okay. And at this moment I walked up to Pavel again and asked him if I could uh, continue to pray for him. So I asked God to uh, fill him up with the Holy Spirit to touch Pavel again. And while I am praying for Pavel, we can see one of his friends who has uh, a stomach problem. And David is uh, laying his hands on him, praying for him, for healing. Okay. Does your does his stomach still hurt? Uh, uh, Dolores? Yeah. No. Wow. Okay. Praise, God. Praise God. Praise God. Gloria a Dios. Gloria a Dios. Hallelujah. 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 <laughs> tell him God loves him. <laughs> yes. Tell it tell him. He very, needs to know. Very nice man. What? What he has to know? That God loves him. Yeah. And he wants his heart. Yeah, yeah. He healed his arm. He thought he did not he thought he did not deserve it. But God is showing him that he, he wants to touch him. Oh it's uh, it's okay man. His arm is good or not? Good? Yes it is. It's it's good. Good. Yeah. And his stomach is good. Yeah. Because sometimes you go through life with people people making fun of you, people putting you down. But God just lifted him up and God showed him value. The one who created him. Yeah, God is touching his heart right now. You will see this man change. Yeah. And as you can see, Pavel, he walks off again. And we don't know where he's going, but he walks toward his car. And then he steps into his car and he sits down there and he locks all four doors. 
and there he sits for a while. So he wanted uh, probably to sit down by himself a little bit. And after a while he comes back again. <laughs> 